Hello guys, welcome back to the Cooking and Baking Bros, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make a uh, basic hard-boiled egg. Let's go. Okay, so the uh, first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to grab your butter. And, well, you're actually going to want to uh, preheat the oven about to 5 to 4 on the uh, oven thing. So then you're going to want to grab your butter, and you're going to want to take about maybe this much off. You're going to want to put it on the pan, and that's going to make an easy surface for the eggs to cook. So, yeah, and uh, while that's warming up, you're going to want to open up your egg carton. You're going to want to grab one egg and then put a bowl in it. As you can see here, you're going to want to put paper towel underneath your bowl. Wait, where am I going? You want to put paper towel underneath your bowl so that the eggshell doesn't get cracked or anything. So, this egg really quick. Crap. Hang on. Uh, hi, sorry for the uh, weird pause. So I am uh, I dropped an egg, so uh, we're gonna have to do it again with this one. Let me just. As you can see right here, you're gonna crack it and then you're gonna. Plop the egg in the bowl just like that. Then maybe spread the butter around a little bit, maybe. There we go. It wasn't even like fully preheated. But yeah, there should be a little, you just want to let the butter sit like right in the center of the pan and let it melt for a little bit. And so as you can see, you put your egg, I kind of pierced the yolk a little bit, yolk a little bit but it's okay. So once this uh, heats up, you're going to want to pour the egg into the uh, pan. But I'm just letting this heat up really quick. should probably grab a spatula. Here we go. Yeah, you're going to need a spatula too. So that you can like dig the egg out and plop it on your plate. Oh, I need a plate. <laughs> yeah, you always want to uh, grab a plate too. So right here, just want to have a quick plate. So here, I'll just bring it down. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but it's kind of starting to sizzle, so then you can just spread it around a little bit. And then, if it's bubbling, that's good. Turn it down just a little bit, and then you're going to want to plop the egg into the pan. It's kind of split up. I pierced the yolk, but it, it, it'll be okay. I'll just, um, just kind of make it around that. It's kind of upset. I'll just, I'll just split it into two parts. Yes. Now you're going to want to turn it up like in between 4 and 5, the oven. And you're just going to want to let that sit for a little bit, maybe turn it up a little bit to make it go faster. But yeah, that, while that's cooking, um, yeah, you're going to want to grab your plate and have it ready right next to your pan so you can just plop the egg in. It's just cooking right now. So once the egg starts to like harden up, and then you know that it's finished cooking, but right now it's like barely done anything, so I'm just waiting for it. Alright, so it's the yolk starting to harden up a little bit, that's good. I'm just I've just gotta wait a little bit for it. But I mean it doesn't really matter how your eggs look, it's more how they taste. If they taste good, that's a good thing. So. Turn it down a little bit. And yeah, it's uh, almost done um, getting heated up. So uh, just wait maybe another 30 seconds or so. Oop, that is popping. You're definitely going to want to turn that down. See, if it starts bubbling like that, that can get a little dangerous and it can burn you. So you're going to want to just step away from it if that does happen. That's not supposed to happen, but... You're 
I'll turn that way down. Just like let it sit a little bit. And then you're gonna wanna like get like weight under that egg. You wanna flip it. And let that side cook, so yeah. But I that didn't turn out too bad. So you're just gonna let that cook for just a little bit. And uh, while that cooks, get your plate ready so that you can put it right on. And uh, that should be good enough. You're going to want to grab that and you're just going to plop it right on your plate. And yeah, that's all there really is for today's video. But yeah, you have your hard boiled egg right there. It's not the greatest hard boiled egg I've ever made, but it's uh, just a way. So just follow the steps in this video if you need help again. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching and just make sure to subscribe and comment and a like. So thank you. See you in the next one.